Perry Merchant, Mario Lopez, and of course Manny Pacquiao and Timothy Bradley. Very even first two rounds. You think that probably Pacquiao got the second round on the judges' score sheet. This is round three. Same with the jabs. Manny making a miss. Caught him with a decent right hand. There's a lot of advertising on the canvas, and this time of the night, the last fight of the night, it gets wet. And it's a little slippery out there in some spots. Well, we had some ice previously in that, uh, down there, and I don't know if they, they got it away enough, but, uh, quick enough, but it's definitely possible could have melted in. There's been a lot of sweat there throughout tonight. Well, it doesn't look like there's a lot of compassion in Manny Pacquiao here tonight. Now, by those big left hands, Larry, his hair looks like it's angry. Well, he's down three, four, five in the row here. Big, big left hands. It's a nice round for Manny Pacquiao. And there goes the footwork. That caused, I believe, those foot, those foot problems earlier for Bradley. Manny just dominated that last about 30, 40 seconds. Bradley tries to hang on and whack him. Manny slapping his, gums to get, his gloves together as old, wanted to fight. Bradley starts to wing some shots. Manny hangs on him. And Manny Bellis does his job. Winging shot again by Tim. Misses again. In the meantime, Pacquiao whacked him with a body shot. Bradley's coming back smartly here. landing big shots on Bradley. Bradley landed a couple solid body shots on his own. He continues to work the body, which is a great game plan. Nice last few seconds for Tim to And Tim walks very slowly back to his corner. Good observation, Larry. <laughs> Two rounds to one Pacquiao in my book. Here we're going to take a look at Manny. Well, first, a couple of vicious body shots by Bradley to the body. Manny answering, giving a big body shot of his own, coming back with big combinations. Manny never answers with just one shot, constantly moving, coming from different angles. That's what makes him so dangerous. Yeah. It's the power of the surprise punch and the angles that come from fighters don't ordinarily see and that's why he's had so much success against bigger guys all right we get ready to go to round number four here the mgm grand garden arena las vegas and out of this manny pacquiao on the white tim bradley in the camouflage trunks and tim picks it up right away well, is bradley taking the bet that manny can't go 12 hard rounds and that he can because he just keeps coming forward. Well, Larry, like we mentioned earlier, he feels like he's got something to prove, even though really he doesn't, based on the Provinikov and Marquez fights. But well, there are some fighters who always think every time they have something to prove. Marvin Hagler is that way. And that's what made him great? Yeah. It, uh, they had to earn their popularity over a long haul and they just had to go out there and do it every time 
and that chip on their shoulder is what keeps them long. And that was a big looping right hand that Pacquiao just took, and he took it well, walking out, uh, backing up with his head straight up, how he got caught with Marquez when he was first knocked down in their last fight. Round four, Timothy Bradley trying to pick up the pace here. This is much more even than the last round was. Him trying to keep pressure on Pacquiao constantly. Pacquiao waits, gets off that uh, left hand lead for him, the southpaw. Touches up, Bradley slowed down just a bit for the moment. More than halfway through, this is the fourth round. And still very much up for grabs. Tim lands him. Nice yeah. straight right hand. Oh, 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 my God. You might have staggered him. Well, that's Pacquiao backing up, and Pacquiao's not used to being the counterpuncher. And that's how he got caught with Marquez, and Marquez was aggressive in their last fight the first time with his head back up. I don't think Manny's legs are 100% right now. Well, I agree with you. He's backing up with his head straight up, and Bradley can sense it. And at no time during the Pacquiao assault, and Bradley was badly hurt. But I really think that uh, Manny felt that. And good body shot by that guy. Yeah, you wouldn't know by what he's doing right now, but he was starched with that one shot by Tim Bradley. But I think he's won the rest of the round rather clearly, so how do you score? I don't know. <laughs> well, we still got 30 seconds left, so let's see. Some guys say damage done, and if that's the case, yep. Tim's done enough. If not, then Manny's won the round. And that's why this is so tough for the judges. Loading up the shots is Tim again. Misses with a left. Catches him with a right. Hand. Well, I mean, hurt Manny once, why wouldn't he think he could do it again? I think he thinks he can play. In the closing seconds, who wants it now? See if anybody can get a final assault going here. To make it definitive, Tim tries it. Really winging hard shots. 